Daily Routines for Volume 1, Unit 1, First Grade. Boys and girls, yesterday we added 3 to get our total of 64. Today we are going to add another 3. Let's find out what the total will be. 64 plus 3 is equal to 67. Did I make a new 10? No, so I will not place my bracket here. What I will need to do is change my equation. My equation will then begin by saying 67 is equal to 60 plus 7. The next part is the finger wiggle. I am the break apart stick and I will say freeze in between your ones and your tens. On our right hand side you will represent the ones. On the left hand side you will represent the tens. Let's begin. We will go to the number 67. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, freeze, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67. Great job. Just like we added three to our number 64, we are going to do the same with the money flip chart. I'm going to add three pennies. One, two, three. Which now means I have a total of seven pennies in this column. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I have seven pennies. Now I need to change the number of pennies located under this column to seven equals. Let's go ahead and count. 10 plus 10 plus 10 plus 10 plus 10 plus 10 plus seven is equal to 67. Let's double check. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, plus 7 more is equal to 67. Using our number path, we are going to add 3 more. 1, 2, three. That now also makes 67. Now we need to check our equation. Our equation is 64 plus 3. Sixty four plus three equals sixty seven. Now I need to add three more to my proof picture. Have I made a new 10? No. So I go ahead and am able to now count 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67. Our next activity is to find 67 using our secret code cards. I have made the number 67 using my secret code cards. How do I know it's 60 and 7? 60 plus 7 is equal to 67. When I turn them over, I then find that I have six tens. 10, 20, 30, 40, 
50, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67.